if you're working in the field of machine learning and specifically deep learning you probably found out that your laptop is not enough uh, for let's say doing training or even doing predictions in high dimensional data such as in the case of computer vision so normally what it would take in a normal computer like about a couple hours it can take up to a few days your laptop so basically if uh, browsing through the internet, I found the solution for this and it basically involves you connecting an external graphic card to your laptop in such a manner that this graphic card will hold the models and do the predictions and even the training steps so, so basically you will need five different components the external graphic card dock a desktop graphic card a desktop power supply an external monitor and a USB Wi-Fi dongle. So first thing, the graphic card dock. Uh, there is one being sold on Amazon and eBay called EXP GDC Beast. I think that they have the monopoly on this because I couldn't find any other that wasn't for like, let's say Thunderbolt, which is what most people use in this case. In my case, I don't have a MacBook. I have a normal uh, Lenovo which has a PCI Express 1X port that I can connect this into a dock which will be a 16X PCI Express for the graphic card uh, regarding the graphic card you should get an NVIDIA graphic card because uh, most frameworks such as CAFE, TensorFlow they benefit from the API of CUDA in my case I don't have an NVIDIA gra graphic card at this point so I'm just using an IMD just for the testing. This is the power supply. Be sure to get one of at least 400 watts. And that's the Wi-Fi dongle. So you wanna take your laptop, flip it off, try to open it. By the way, before buying anything, just be sure that your laptop has a PCI Express 1X port because otherwise there is no way you can use this dock. So this thing right here is the uh, PCI Express 1X slot. You will find your Wi-Fi card connected to it and that's why we need this external, uh, this extra Wi-Fi dongle because we're gonna substitute this card with that Wi-Fi dongle otherwise your laptop will not have wireless just take off the antenna just with a sling fingertip it should come really easily and then connect the external dock PCI Express connector So once that, that end is in the computer, this other end will be a HDMI connection which go will go directly into the dock. You also need to power up the dock, so for that you will use this adapter that comes into the external graphic card package. So you connect one of the ends uh, to the motherboard purpose connector from your power supply and the other end to those four pins that usually go to the motherboard as well. So this will power up the dock. Just connect the other end to the dock. Now connect your graphic card to the slot. And also you need to power up the graphic card itself as, as you would do in a desktop PC. So in my case my graphic card needs two connections, so I need a better power supply I guess. Also be sure that your power supply is connected to the current. So bring back your laptop and we are going to connect the other end of the PCI Express connector to the dock.
so I should pretty much uh, just connect the HDMI or VGA connection to your uh, external monitor and that's pretty much it turn on your computer and as soon as you turn it on if you have done everything correctly everything should power up So all that is left now to do is about the software. First, you need to disable your integrated graphic card. I would also recommend that installing the updates because that way you prevent conflicts. And then just go to the manufacturer of the graphic card webpage and download the latest drivers.